And several issues took center stage at Josh Stein's campaign rally for governor today on ECU's campus. This all happening at the same time as the Trump rally. News 12's Billiana Garland was there. She joins us live in Greenville with a breakdown of what Stein plans to do differently than his opponent, Lieutenant Governor Mark Robinson. Stein was right here at ECU's campus, and there were dozens of people inside. Some were teachers, some were students, and there were even just community members there as well. But many came with their Harris and Waltz campaign shirts already on, and most of the people inside say that they already casted their ballots for the Democratic Party. In his speech, Stein emphasized the importance of protecting abortion access, increasing funding for public schools, and standing up for the younger generation by suing social media giants TikTok and Instagram, which he says are harming young minds. Recently, Mark Robinson said Stein's policies don't work and say North Carolinians need someone tougher on crime and other issues in our state. I've been focused trying to get the people of North Carolina to a better place. We saw the CNN report, called himself a black Nazi, praised Hitler, glorified slavery. It is despicable. But there's not a person in this room we need to do that CNN story to know that that man is unfit to be our governor. Robinson has recently came out and filed a lawsuit against CNN for that report back in September, saying it was false. Both Robinson and Stein were in West North Carolina recently to help with relief efforts as well. Today, Stein called out on utility providers to give Hurricane Helene survivors in our state unlimited data and high-speed internet and to reimburse bills when services were down. Stein says that he is more than qualified to become governor because he was state senator before and now he is the current attorney general. And Stein said much more in his speech as well as answering questions from me as well. So you will hear more about that coming up at 10. Live in Greenville, Bilyana Garland, News 12.